If you just paid attention to a man's actions and no attention to his words, and most importantly, paid no attention to how you feel about what he did, but just what he did, you would be much happier. If you would choose the man who took the right action and you didn't worry so much about how you felt about it, you would be much, much happier. <laughs> oh boy, that was fucking solid, bro. That was, I say that shit all the time. I, you have, like you took the words right out of my mouth for the last two fucking months. Like I, w I was dating this guy for two months and we just got to the point where it was like, and, and, I'm, and I'm literally telling him, I'm like, I don't care what you have to say to me. You, you can say all the fuck you want, but guess what? Your actions is a louder, a, yeah. a louder communication than you speaking to me. I'm like the actions that you're taking yeah. are the ones that I'm fucking listening to. And now that now that I'm like now he's blocked. Like now I'm just I'm like you're you're done. So so one of the things where I think people get wrong, men do this and women do this, is they think because I like you, you should like me. Oh right? but boy. The, but the thing is, for a woman, she's going to like you back if she's attracted to you. Mm -hmm. And for me as a man, I'm gonna like her back if she respects me. Mm -hmm. You respecting me means more to me than you liking me. Oh, that that's the thing. So so understanding the boundaries of Oh my god. I literally cause I, oh my god. Pound it. Yeah. Pound it. It says bro. In the, it says in the it says Wanted in the Bible. Break the mic. I know, right? I'm sorry. No, it's because like I I literally told I I've I've been saying this for probably like the last like 2 years. I've been saying I'm like I don't it's not that I don't believe in love, but I don't believe in just love. Yeah. I'm like I have to trust you first because trusting you coincides with respecting you. Yeah. If I can trust you, I can respect you. If I can trust and respect you, then I can love you. Yeah. <clears throat> but aside from that, I'm like, love is not real. Love alone is not real. I, cannot, yeah. I cannot love you without trusting and respecting you. Yeah. Me falling in love, like this whole, this whole head over heels, like I, I was that girl, I was delusional as fuck. I thought that, you know, our yeah, relationship. The, do the dopamine and the serotonin for some <laughs> women and men too is enough to carry them through the relationship <laughs> when they see when there's other red flags. And the right. thing is, like it says in the Bible, it's like if you love me, keep my commandments. And it's the same thing in my relationship. If you love me, the word that starts with an L means nothing. Yeah. You need to respect the things that I ask you to do. That's how yeah. you show me. Again, there were a bunch of people waving American flags back in the 1940s, saying "I love America," but there were a few men who stormed Normandy Beach and lost their lives storming those Russian machine gun positions, right. those men actually loved, loved their country. Mm -hmm. they, they loved their country through action, whereas the rest of the people were waving flags. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. So as, as a man, and I'm, saying, well, I'm not saying women don't do this, but as a, in general, a man is going to let you know he wants to marry you by asking you to marry him. Mm -hmm. uh, when she sa when he, he says all these things, well, you know, I want to marry you, but I'm doing this. No, he's fucking someone else. He's lying to you. <laughs> <laughs> but you don't see that because he's saying these words and you're convinced that these words are true. Words if, are not true. If women would spend more time paying attention to a man's actions yes. and less time paying attention to how they feel, they would be much, much happier.